Pirates, welcome back to the 2018-2019 school year. We have a message from the Twinsibles. Good morning, good morning, our Pirates. This is Dr. Richardson. This is Dr. R.E. Richardson. And we're your Twinsibles slash co-principals here at San Leandro High School. We want to welcome our ninth, incoming ninth graders, class of 2022. And we also, we're so excited to have you here. We're excited for our seniors, class of 2019, as they embark on their endeavors of preparing to go off for college and career. So we want to send out a positive message and we want to focus on our virtues and continuing to exemplify our virtues throughout the day on campus and off campus. And one of the focus points uh, this year, we're gonna, every month, every Twinsible segment, this is the first Twinsible segment, uh, we're going to focus on discipline yourself so no one has to. So it's very important that you understand that disciplining yourself so no one ha else has to is actually a virtue that you live by and it's going to help you out throughout life. Yeah, it's about teaching. Discipline means to teach. Teach yourself to be a better person every day. It goes a long way when you say something positive to another human being. And they remember those moments when you lift them up, you lift their spirit up, and they'll never forget it. So it sets the tone for our climate and culture. Positivity will take our school to an even higher level in regards to how we interact with the, one another and how we support each other. So let's just be positive on a daily basis and discipline ourselves to be positive on a daily basis. Are you referring to using positive language versus destructive language? Yes, and, and taking accountability when you hurt someone's feelings. Like when you apologized to me the other day, I, it really, you know, it d builds up my spirit when you just held yourself accountable and said, you know, Reggie, I apologize yeah. for hurting your feelings. So I thank you for that. I feel a lot better now. Yeah, I want to apologize to you again because I, I really reflected on what I said, yeah. and I shouldn't have said that in public in Starbucks. Um, I, I definitely should have took you aside and talked to you privately instead of putting you on blast in front of wow. strangers. And I, I want to say in front of the whole world, I love you, and I, and I'm, wow. I, I apologize for offending you. And wow. it, it won't happen again. I love you too, and to say that in front of the world, in front of the world, I just a world to me because I I love you. You're my, you're my twin wow. brother. You're my hero, and uh, wow, I need to be more professional. That's my birthday present. Thank you. Yeah. So um, I, I hope um, you learn from me, your co-principal, your principal, Dr. Richardson. Even I make mistakes. I just learned from you today. Oh, wow. Thank you. Yes. And and that's our first segment of the Twinsibal Show live in our broadcasting studio in our slam building. Our pirates and go class of 2019. Over and out. Over and out. Have a great day. And now a message from campus security. Hey Pirates, welcome back. This is Ms. Christie, your campus supervisor. I'm here to introduce our former AD, new assistant principal, Jason Strickland. Our Pirates! I am so happy to be a part of this amazing team in a little bit of a different capacity this year. Wanted to talk about a few expectations as we get the year going. First, the plaza. I know a lot of you scholars like to be there and we love to support that. However, we can't be there after 8, 8 a.m. once school starts and until school ends. So the plaza is off limits. Even for you ROP students, anybody, if you're in school, you need to stay in school and not at the plaza. Also, we know a lot of you get hungry during the day, uh, getting all that energy to go to your classes. We cannot any longer allow for food delivery services. The expectation is for you to stay in school. We have free breakfast every day. We have lunch served every day. And if you're hungry, a lot of the offices can, can support you with any food nutrition that you need. So if you do end up doing any of these things, we'll have to let your parents know kind of the expectation that we have. So please, please, as we start this school year, let's start strong. Let's make sure we're not at the plaza and we're not doing any sort of food delivery services. And now for some new FTK transportation policy, our campus supervisor extraordinaire, Christy. So Pirates, please, this year we want to emphasize using all crosswalks. So there's a crosswalk across from student services, leaving main campus, and the crosswalk at 136 in Bancroft. You may also use the crosswalks exiting FTK on 138th. Please utilize all crosswalks. Thank you. Ms. Christie, quick question. Yes. Um, if it's a red light, what should I do at the crosswalk? Red at the crosswalk means stop. 
Oh, I stop at the red light. You stop at so the I red light. So I don't go across the crosswalk. You do not. Okay, perfect. Will we be these, there's somebody be there to help me and support me in case I forget that? There will be two campus supervisors to support you good. That Back is so and forth amazing. between FTK that campus so and amazing. main campus. You're welcome. You see how excited I am to be a part of this team? I do. Go get it, Pirates. Go Pirates. And with that, have a great first day of school, Pirates. Arg.